Hi, I'm Lori with Coachman's Apex Division. Apex has an ultralight travel trailer lineup wherein we give you 20 plus floor plans all under 6,000 pounds. We're going to start our lineup with a single axle travel trailer, move into our expandables, seven and a half foot wide, eight foot wide, and eight foot wide deep slides. That gives you over 20 plus floor plans to choose from with your half ton towable. We can even haul our, haul our Apex with a SUV or even some minivans. First of all, I want to start talking about our, our front cap. Our front cap is actually a painted fiberglass front cap. Our competitors tend to use a gel cap. That gel coat cap is going to fade over time and we don't, our gel coat, we actually use a painted fiberglass front cap. The benefits to that is it's actually painted so that when something happens to it, we can easily fix it repaint it and move on. You're not going to have the hazing that you would have with a gel coat. We also wrap our front cap. You'll notice that you do not see a seam here right at the front. As we're going down the highway, this takes a lot of abuse over time. Having the side wrap actually allows that to be sturdier and eliminating leaks and things like that. As we move around the side of the coach, I'd like to bring up just a couple features that we put in our Apex. We use two 20-pound LP tanks. Why do we do that? Because on a Sunday afternoon when you run out of LP, you don't have to go to a propane tank. Fill station, you can actually go to your gas station. We actually use a power tongue jack. The ease of taking your trailer off your truck and moving on is as simple as one button. Moving along the side of our coach, you'll notice that we have the LED lights on our front cap as well. That's just an aesthetic feature that just gives you the cool factor as you're on the campgrounds. Let's talk a little bit about construction because that's really what makes the Apex special above the rest. Coachman tends to overbuild our trailers as we like to call it and we take pride in that. So your Apex is going to be an aluminum cage. You're going to have your sidewalls, your roof, and your floor all aluminum tubular construction. We also put the, the aluminum in our perimeter openings. Our competitors a lot of times just cut out an opening and stick in the window or stick in the, the door for your storage. You're going to a lot of storage in our Apex. The reason why I do that is you've got an ultralight, but you've got to be able to take stuff with you when you go. This is a lighted pass-through, so at night if you need to, to see what you've got in your storage, you can move with that as well. I always like to bring up the fact that we insulate our doors. That gives another feature to our construction. So take a look at this door. It's very heavy, very insulated, shows our construction. We also use our slam latch, metal, and magnet catches something like a fifth wheel would have in its construction. Moving down the side of the coach, you'll notice the nice gray fiberglass exterior. What's behind that? I mentioned the aluminum tubing, but what's probably most important is what we use as our backer to our fiberglass. A lot of our competitors use Luon, which is a wood paneling. We use a product called Asdel. Asdel is a man-made product. It's a polypropylene blend. What does that mean for you? you're getting 50% lighter material. It's not going to smell, you're not going to have any odors, but probably most important, it's impervious to water. What does that mean? If you happen to get a crack in your wall, if you, there's an opening where water can get in, this, this Asdel is not going to soak up that water. You're not going to have the delamination problems or worrying about your walls starting to deteriorate over time. That is a really key feature in the Apex, and I, and I ask that you look for that in your other products as well. As we move on down the coach, there's a couple features I'd also like to bring up that are maybe a little bit different than the others. One would be our frameless windows. Now that's an option for our customers, but what it gives them is a really contemporary look. It also gives them the feature and benefit of being able to open the windows on, it on an, a rainy day. You get to have that open air feeling, but not having to worry about water going into the coach. Moving again on down the coach, we're going to talk about our aluminum wheels and nitrogen-filled tires. What's the benefit to that? Most people might not even realize that when you fill a tire with nitrogen, you're going to get better gas mileage. You're not going to have to worry about that air dissipating from your tire as quickly as you would with a standard tire. Aluminum wheels look fabulous, but they also don't chip rust over time as well. As we move down to the end of the coach, you'll notice that we have a full-length power awning. All of our Apex products have a power awning, which makes it very easy to use and move in and out 
whenever you need to. You'll notice the blue lights underneath as well. Again, that's just for looks, but it also gives you that nice curb appeal as you're sitting at your campsite. The last feature I'd like to talk about is our outside kitchens. A lot of our floor plans will have an outside kitchen with varying different um, features. Maybe a refrigerator, maybe a stove, maybe an, an outside sink. This particular unit has the, just the outside refrigerator to give you extra space to put those beverages and keep from running in and out of the coach. Now I'd like to take you inside and show you some of our key features in our Apex. Let's take a look at some of the interior features that we have in this 250 RLS. This is one of our newer floor plans. It's actually a couple's coach, but does offer extra sleeping capacity if you want to bring guests with you. Let's start off in the bedroom because we have some neat features in here that you may not see in some of our competitors. As we step into the bedroom, you'll notice that we have a really neat little alcove above our headboard. That gives you some space to put, there's a light in there, there's USB ports, stick your phone in, plug it in, maybe your book, read at night if you want to, that type of thing. Our sleeping area is an is a RV queen, and that's going to give you a lot of nice space to sleep and a nice comfortable mattress. But what I really want to bring up in here is our wardrobe and our storage. You'll notice that we have overhead storage and it's not just shelving, you actually have cabinetry. You can actually hang up your clothes in our wardrobes on each side of the bed. This is a feature that you won't find in a lot of our competitors. As we move into the restroom, I just like to bring up a few things that are maybe a little bit different. And I'm going to step out through here And bring up our acrylic shower. This is a glass door shower. A lot of our competitors are going to just maybe use a shower door. Now in our bunkhouse units, you will have a small tub with the shower door. But in our two-person coaches, you're going to have the nice new angle shower door. Moving off into our interior living space, again, Apex is known for storage. I always like to open up all our cabinetry to notice our hardwood cabinetry and the way we put things together. This is not a shoddy construction coach. Moving into the living area, you're going to notice a nice, really large U-shaped dinette. All of our, our dinettes tend to be a lot larger than the competitor. You're going to have storage underneath those. Not only are you going to see doors, but you're also going to see this top storage. Why I lift this up is I want to show you the plywood. Simple little product but it sure makes a difference. A lot of our competitors use OSB. What happens with that? That OSB starts to break up over time. It's heavier. It's just not as strong. Okay, this is our latte interior, which is a nice brown leatherette, which is a really nice contemporary look. You'll notice our LED pendant lights give you a residential feel. As we move around the coach over to our sofa, I bring this up because this is actually a trifold high to bed sofa. We can get jackknives in a lot of our floor plans, but this one is going to give you a, a nice queen bed to sleep in. Moving over to the kitchen area, you'll notice all our overhead cabinetry. Again, same construction, countersunk screw, screwed together, not going to have a lot of staples and stuff to pull apart. What I always like to bring up in our kitchens is our countertops and our sink. Why is because they are different than the competition. You'll notice that this has a nice double edge. That looks great, but what we make our countertops out of is what the, what the special part is. This is a vacuum bonded countertop. It's a seamless, solid countertop. So you don't have to worry about that laminate starting to break apart, maybe the T-mold edge coming away, water getting in your countertops, and then you're replacing that. We don't use the standard plastic sink. This is what's called a stone cast sink. Why I bring that up? It's not going to burn. You're not going to have to worry about scratches and stains. I can actually take a pot off my stovetop up to 500 degrees directly from the stovetop into the sink, and you're not going to have to worry about burning. So this is a really nice key feature in here. You'll notice our flooring. Flooring is flooring, right? But we use a Congolian product. It has a three-year cold cracking, which is much different than the two years. So you're not going to have to worry about over time your floor is starting to crack and that type of thing. On the outside, we talked about our tubular construction. I also forgot to tell you or, or just tell you about how we put those together. We use a pinch roll system and we also use a vacuum bond system. That gives you a double lamination process. We do that on our floors and our roof. 
So our walls and roof and floor are very solid, giving you a higher R factor and just a sturdier coach. We use all LED lights on the interior of these coaches. What, why do we do that? The draw is less, uses less electricity, but it's also a brighter coach. You'll notice nice brightness in this, in this room, much like you would have at home. This is our entertainment center, right? 32 inch TV, depending on what type of floor plan we're in, it may be in an entertainment center that can swing around into the bedroom. This particular one obviously is fixed to the wall here. It does have an arm that we can move it around for your viewing pleasure. We use an upgraded um, AM FM radio with CD and DVD player. This is all also now Bluetooth ready for our techie people that like to use um, their Bluetooth capacities. Those are some of the key features of the Apex. Come and check us out. We're at RV General.